I know anytime I talk about British literature from the early 1800s, a lot of us, like my coworkers, get that glassy-eyed look. I mean, Ken, come on now. I, the incomparable Jane Austen, Katie. What? Jane Austen, she wrote some of the finest novels in the English language, from Pride and Prejudice to Sense and Sensibility. <laughs> come on, guys, snap out of it. What if I told you there's a new play bringing her life to work? Let's head to the theater, shall we? <laughs> And may I present for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Weston! It's Emma on stage right now at Denver Center's Wolf Theater. I saw it Friday night. Folks, this ain't your grandma's Jane Austen. Of course, the novel was always sort of a rom-com. Emma sees herself as a matchmaker, but bumbles her way through a series of miscommunications. But this time it's infused with a fresh perspective, modern touches, modern music, and it's a wildly fun set. And the director goes deeper, this time really exploring what it's like to be a smart, well-educated woman who isn't allowed to do anything with her intelligence. I love the humor. I love the heart. It is not for everybody. In some ways, the comedy of errors is a little tired. But all in all, I'm going to give Emma four out of five snappy British retorts. It's a fine play. You ought to go see it playing right now at the Denver Center. There. Now is British literature a little more interesting to you? <laughs> <Nope>. <laughs> Go see the play. You'll change your mind. Trust me, Travis. It's a good one.